and in Tennessee we're going to be doing something to the RV so if you want to know what that is just watch So it's travel day, and we're not traveling because we can't find Ruth's car keys, and I don't know where they went. They were hanging on the thing we always normally have. So we're not going anywhere right now. <laughs> no, we're calling a locksmith. Yeah. All right, so Miss Ruth is in there. I had to figure out. Lift that little thing up. That, yep. That's how you gotta undo the freaking break the parking to put it in neutral. So now I get to push this. All right. Put the brake when it is not gonna. It's not gonna work because it's too much that way. How you doing? No Cute time. dog. <laughs> I'm trying to think if I can pull it. If I hook up like that, can I pull it? Turn it this way. I don't know. I just think I'm, I'm. I don't have enough to swing. I don't think. Let's push it back. I need to be ready to go when I do this. All right, put the brake on. Can you go check, please? That way I can finish doing this and then we can, I can connect and try to swing it out wide. Thank you. We're gonna have to find a Volkswagen dealership to get a new key. So there's there's plenty of them in Knoxville. All right, Ruth. This. I think so. Yeah. Because we just <sighs> gotta love it. She looked everywhere. Oh, we looked. That's the first place we checked. And there, we think maybe they got accidentally thrown away, maybe. Oh, great. So, <sighs> it's not that big. Yeah. <laughs> we looked in between seats, underneath this, that, inside. Ah. It's all right, Ruth, just a key. We'll get another one. Yeah. You know? So. I know, I know. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's. We'll just make sure we take the uh, make sure we take the registration because you're gonna need it to show that it's your car. I don't need a title. We just need the VIN. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's get let's get the rest of the stuff. I'll pull up. I could pull up over there where I'll be out of the way. Cause that way I'm not blocking this and we'll push the car back and all that. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. <sighs> Oh man, this is soaking wet. My socks are soaked now. <laughs> oh geez, oh well. Fun, fun in the sun. All right. Pass me a broom while I'm up here. 
I can get the slide. Yep, all those days, RV life. Welcome to it. All right, I need my keys. Where's my keys? I need to unlock the hitch. You know what, let me look at my jacket for the hell of it. Oh my God, Adrian. <laughs> are you kidding me right now? How the hell are they there? An hour and a half we've been looking. I've had these today, because I had to undo the bikes and this to, to drive. Hour and a half. You've had me an excruciating. I didn't have you anything, baby. You just. I cannot believe they were in his jacket this whole time. An hour and a half. An hour and a half. An hour and a half. Thank you, Lord. What? You had my jacket on the other day, baby. Not that same. <laughs> yes, yes, He's baby. trying to blame me. I'm not blaming anyone. I'm glad we found them, Jeff. It's not about that. It's chill, okay? He's trying to blame me. Look where the car's at. We pushed it over there. Well, that was crazy. Almost two hours looking for a damn key. And for whatever reason, it was in my jacket pocket. She wore my jacket the other day. Maybe she put it in there. Maybe I put it in there. I don't know. Um, the important part is that we have it. So that's saved us $300 or whatever it is to get a key made nowadays. At least somebody's relaxed. Yep. Finally. Well, we're on our way to. But our first stop, a busy one, is Tennessee. And in Tennessee, we're going to be doing something to the RV. So if you want to know what that is, just watch. to learn you know because we know so many people they have RVs as well um, I was able to get in contact with them and get their opinions where it's not just somebody online saying it we decided to go with the Goodyear Endurance um, because they seemed like they were the best for the value tires plus has them so um, I'm going to Tennessee this, this trip was coming and we're going you know more north and all that, I wanted to be safe. I've already got probably 4,000 miles or more on this uh, on these tires since I bought the thing. So I want to make sure that we're safe and those will last me for a little while. What do you think, Ruth? Yep. I'll feel much better and safer. Yeah, they, they hold the weight a little better, a little more than what these do. I don't even know, I couldn't find specs for them. 
and for sure you know they have that sidewall it's like a sidewall extra thickness of rubber around it because you know what we all try to be careful and we all try not to hit those curbs but sometimes it's just unavoidable it's either go to Pajo or hit a curb like it's you know whatever so so yeah that's what we're going to do right now all right so I had to pull down this alleyway just so they can uh, be able to get these tires done so let's go check it out So they go on the same way, just on the inside? Yeah, so the, the, the inside cal or calculate for the difference of the machine itself. Okay. Um, so for tra traditional balance, either it's either going to be a tape weight on the inside closer to the base, or it's going to have that clip weight on the outside. So the machine will calculate the, um, just for that. Right. Like, same thing with these jeeps here. So with those bigger tires, sometimes it's harder to balance them out with yeah. the static clip or tape weight. So it's all towards the base on the inside okay. uh, to help balance it out more evenly. What's your name? My name is Zach. Zach, appreciate it. You guys need tires? If you're in Knoxville, just come here. Tires Plus. Man, you guys are like a NASCAR team. Hey, question for you. Did those tires look bad or were they still in good shape? Or? Still really good shape. Were you having an issue out of them? No, I just get worried because they're tied to bottom. All right, you guys heard it yourself. Um, tires were in good shape, but you know what? I'd rather be safe. Rather be safe. Take a look over here. Everything looks like it's in good shape. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right. All done. Finished up. Less than 30 minutes. All right, Ruth. So they're done. They were like a pit, like a pit crew. In wow, NASCAR. that's pretty quick. Yeah, honey's being a baby crying. Ooh, makes me nervous. Did you interview any of them? Kind of, yeah. Okay. okay. Stop. And there they are. Now we got
that our tires will go into the first our first stop. Mm, yep. We're going to our first campground and you remember the name of it? Yes. No. <laughs> I don't. But I will tell you that it's waterfront. You know I gotta have yeah, water that's waterfront. The, you know what happens that's when she wants waterfront. You've seen other videos, so let's see what happens this time. <sighs> Negative Nelly. Mm -hmm. Negative Adrian. It's real Adrian. You know what? Out of all the campgrounds that no. I have booked, because I'm the one who plans it out. We only had two that were, were bus. Exactly. So you know no, what? No, only one. Only that little mini one. Exactly. I so needed, I'm doing. I needed like so I'm traveling doing good. Roberts so mini 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 so, mini that. And he is going to have to eat his words. Oh, I'm not complaining. I'm not. So we're gonna, we are going to unhook, and then we're gonna go see family. Yep. And you know, living this lifestyle and always on the run. And you know, I mean, besides living in RV, we live in Georgia, so you don't get to see a lot of family. But I have a cousin that lives here in in Tennessee. So we're going to go visit him. I haven't seen him in for a little while. Since our wedding. Since our wedding. So it's going to be kind of nice to see see him and check him out. And it's, you know, it's nice to see some family once in a while. Okay, we are here. No, that's it. Sorry. And I think it's yes. gonna be easy to get in. Very waterfront. So there's our baby with the new tires. Our baby got new boots, new shoes. New shoes. So that's quick and easy. This is nice to know. Like we can stay here the next time I come forward. Yep. This costs what per the whole time what one room would cost me uh, for a hotel room. You're welcome, Greg. So not only was it inexpensive to begin with but if you're a good sam's member you get a discount there and if you're a veteran or an active duty military member you also get an additional discount so it's pretty good and i will tell you i believe i'm not sure if it's full hookup i believe it's just water and electric because typically by the water by the water that's what and I will suffer. I took a long shower this morning. It's a dump station there. That's the bathhouse there. I'm not too sure about that bathhouse. Okay. He's starting again to doubt me. 
you. How am I starting to touch you? It's water, but I don't know what kind of water it is. Oh well, it's water, right? It's hydration. Yeah, kind of like when you need moisture in your face, you use water. Okay, so here we go again. Here we go again, trying to fit into this space. He's mad at me because here we're by the water. I mean, I don't see pictures of these places. Like, how am I supposed to know that, you know, these are tight, like, not the best spots, like, He's the one who wanted to stay here. Hold on! Okay, now. Before you, you were a little too close before, but you're good now. You're good. No, you're good. You're good. I'm not gonna hit that station, right? No, you're far from the station, way far. Let me go look. You're way far. I told you. Listen, listen to your wife. Remember? Listen to your wife. You could go back. Huh? No, I don't like this spot, man. I know, okay, right there. Oh boy, here we go again. What? I think I can bring it this way some more. You can. I'll stand over no, here. I'm glad come to here. You're gonna leave it there? All because I want it that. Let's unhook. Look at that again.